Dream Universe NXT August Week 2 Faction Wars continues on NXT. Starting with the opener, ECW takes on Nexus for the opener. Two strong uh, factions going at it right here in the opener. Sabu, NXT uh, world champion ever since ECW invaded NXT. And uh, Taz still remains ECW champion. And then we have uh, Ryback on Nexus, who just became a WWE champion. And of course, uh, CM Punk uh, coming from AEW back to uh, WWE, working two promotions now. And Bray Wyatt, both uh, high-rated superstars. So uh, this should be a good one for the opener. Mm -hmm. And for the second Faction War, round two, LWO versus Diamond Mine. Uh, I think the LWO have a slight advantage here with Hall of Famer veteran Rey Mysterio on the team versus uh, this young uh, wrestling base faction, Diamond Mine, versus a uh, high flying base faction, LWO, and we will we will see. Who will come out on top. Alright, for the third match in our first championship match for the NXT Cruiserweight title. Axiom ranked number one versus the Cruiserweight champion Noam Dar. Championship match number two. Former three-time North American champion Wes Lee versus the new champion Kevin Grimes. Wesley will be exercising his rematch clause after losing the title to Cameron Grimes at SummerSlam. And the third championship match of the night for the NXT Tag Titles. Imperium ranked number two versus uh, New Day. The reigning NXT champions. And it's actually New Day who runs uh, NXT right now with Big E being a universal champion. So I think the winner of Faction Wars might have a chance of taking the show from uh, NXT. We will see. <laughs> and for the main event, the only rival match of the night, Apollo Crews ranked number five in the NXT Title division versus Commander Aziz ranked number two in the North American title division. Both of these guys have uh, two victories each. So this will be rival battle number five, which is the uh, final rival battle. And this will be a rival war match. So either someone's going to get knocked out, submitted, or pinned in this final rival match. And of course, the winner of this wins the rival war and gets the title shot in their respective divisions. <laughs> All right, so let's get this on. <clears throat> ECW versus the reunited Nexus. Wade Barrett calling everybody back to arms from their respective Perspective shows CM Punk coming from AEW and Ryback on Raw and Bray Wyatt on SmackDown all reuniting the Nexus to uh, join this Faction War mini tournament.
The following contest is an elimination match. Introducing first, at a combined weight of 1,004 pounds, the Alliance. Look at this group. Complete domination is their goal, and tonight will be their mission statement. Combined weight of 741 pounds. The Nexus! The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match is going to be good. Just an eerie hush has taken over this entire arena. We are in the midst of an instantly intimidating presence. No one knows what to make of him. The dangerous mystique of Bray Wyatt. You can feel the anticipation here as Bray Wyatt commands the WWE Universe. A man who always succeeds in unnerving his opponents.
feel the dread in the air. Bray Wyatt stared into the abyss, and he liked what he saw. Things getting started in this elimination tag match. Elimination tag matches are so tough, they quickly become a handicap match. Boom, nice. Uh, ooh, twist in the arm, then an elbow right to the shoulder. Well placed, kick to the gut. Another damaging Bang. kick. Oh, yeah, close line to follow. Measuring. Oh, face stop. Gets tagged in. <sighs> Being carried around with ease. <laughs> Driven down face first. Oh, dear. This doesn't look good. Ooh. Arm control applied and a kick right to the midsection. A picture perfect moonsault. RBD playing off his longtime connection to the WWE Universe, trying to get them behind him. Uh oh. Strike. Lights out. Oh! Tag. Oh! Wow! Oh! Inflicting more damage to the leg. The arm absorbing the damage. Oh, face stop. He's looking a little off balance. Short arm clothesline. He thinks he has it. He keeps his team in the match. Look at this. Just unloading. Ouch. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Let's go. There he goes, right out of the corner. Kick to the gut. Oh, brutal for him. What a shot. Reversal. Can he take advantage? It's Mark. Tags him in. There's press. Hackenschmidt bite. Hackenschmidt bite. Someone stop this. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Put into the corner now. Uh-oh, here it comes. In front of Alabama slam. What now? Oh, not to the belly. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. There's the backbreaker. Right across the chest. Oh my, down with authority. He has been here before and he knows what he needs to do. Yes, tag. Elbow puts an end to that.
Oh, Bray gets cut off. This is what he feeds off of. Oh, man, you can see he is feeling it now. Oh, man. Oh, God, terrible position to be in there. Whoa, not quite yet. Look out! Oh, this match grinded him down a little. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. And this is just a vulgar display of ruthlessness. My God, enough! Targeting the arm with a big stomp. Surprises me. 
reaches his partner for the tag. Big head drop kick. Extending their opponent's arm and a big leg drop. An elusive Barrett there. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Slam! What impact! Great counter! Oh, the Larian! <laughs> Set him up with a flat line. Man, face first. Tagged into the action. Right to the spine. He may get the three count right here. This is it. He stops the count for his partner. What more can these two superstars do to each other? What I, more? I think they can do a lot more because they're out on the apron now, Byron. And I think they're about to destroy each other. Wayne Barrett has been eliminated. Boom! Out on the apron. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be really bad. Trap the arm. Well placed, kick to the gut. Another damaging Bang. kick. Nice combo. Another way. Ah, oh, look at this, just cranking it out. Just cranking the head. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Hits him with the counter. Oh, right to the throat. Ooh. Into the corner. Boom, oh, right to the midsection. Good night, nurse. That might be it. Into the cover. Totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. He's got it. Oh, ho, ho. let's get it on. Oh, my God. Stiff elbow will break that up. He's 
stop the count for his partner. Superstars' faces, they're in serious pain at the moment. A lot of punishment has been dished out, but no one is thinking about quitting. Count off with a big one. You don't think. Oh, camel clutch! There it camel is! Clutch. He got in there. Good save. Ooh! Will this be enough? Oh! Come on, ref, get some control. Shut up, Byron. He's heading up top. Thinking big. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. Diving leg drop. It could have been a half moon. And he's got something different in mind here. Wow. What's he got in store? to be a great sense of accomplishment after coming out on top in a match like this. Accomplishment, relief, a little bit of column A and column B, Saxton. Elimination matches are no joke. ECW destroys the Nexus. I did not see that coming. I thought it was going to be a lot more competitive match than that. And Sabu, I mean, just destroying everybody. Three eliminations for uh, ECW by Sabu. So Sabu is definitely gets the MVP award for ECW in this faction war. All right, here we go. Faction war number two, round two. The high-flying LWO faction led by a Hall of Famer and legend, Rey Mysterio, versus the wrestling faction, wrestling-based faction, uh, Diamond Mine, led by Roderick Strong, former Cruiserweight champion. Here we go.
The following is an elimination match. And at a combined weight of 375 pounds, Rey Mysterio and Santos Escobar, Legado del Fantasma. Matches like these with talent of this caliber, this is why sports entertainment is in art form. combined weight of 365 pounds. Cruz Del Toro and Joaquin Wild, Legado Del Fantasma. The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. And at a combined weight of 935 pounds, the superstar Ronnie Strongman, Damon Kemp, Julius Creed, and Brutus Creed, Diamond Mine. So many memorable factions in the history of sports entertainment. If you ask me, this group could very well join that Mount Rushmore. An elimination tag team match certainly puts a unique spin on classic tag team style action. Each member has to be at their best because in the end, you could be out there all on your own, out there without a safety net once your partner's eliminated. Cross body for the win! Kick it out before the count. You expect these pins to last much longer at this stage in the match. Rey Mysterio now setting him up. Satellite DDT. Headbutt. Oh, God, that hurt. Yeah. Oh, now he's been put on the defensive. Oh, using the knee. Hanging his partner in now. And he barely evades. Look at this. Snap suplex. Setting up. Suplex. Vertical suple. Took him out the knee. Right on point. Across the top rope, all the way to the floor. Oh, 
sit out slam. Tagged in. Ah, oh, jumping knee strike. Lights out. Tag made. Fresh man in. In the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. Nothing he can do. Launched with a belly to belly. Out of the way in time. Oh no. And a first DDT. Tag switching it up. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Damon was ready there. And he gets set back into the ring. Ooh. Nasty right hand. It's a go into the floor. Cinched in, looking to break their back. I think he breaks it up. I don't know how much longer his partner could have lasted. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Ooh, stinging kick. So much damage inflicted. I missed you. I wanted to knee you in the face again. Ooh. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Uh oh, just tossed their opponent. Dropped him with a big shoulder tackle. He's getting a little battered now. And tag. He's in now. Finally. Here we go. Ray Mysterio has him in position for the 619. From the apron. Oh, no. Crashing hard onto the floor. Look out. What a DDT. Oh, my goodness. With one hand. Oh. Able to interrupt the attack. And that looked like a rag doll being thrown around. Got to find a way to get out of this. show of confidence or a wasted opportunity to attack your opponent. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Boom, what impact! Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Ah, oh, shot to the back. the target. Distress starting to show on Creed's face. It's a full court press being applied to Creed. Tag made. Tag made. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Counters on top of counters. Sweeps the legs. Stop. Flying Majorana. Beautiful. He's in off the tag. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Uh 
Uh-oh. Blocked the effort and cut them off with a shot to the gut. Control on a suplex. Raped across the top rope. Slippery 
fool in there. here. No way. We're seeing an unbelievable performance in front of us. And how these competitors are still surviving is beyond explanation. Looking to apply an agonizing armbar stretch. Punishing stretch. Escobar's in serious danger. The cover! Two, three, and that's it. Here's Escobar. Has been he eliminated. was eliminated. Taking hold of Del Toro here. Launched with a belly to belly. He's taking some good hits. Right to run into a neck breaker. And Kemp is showcasing his arsenal. And Kemp might have more in store. Julius Creed taking hold. Suplex. Vicious forearm right in the skull. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Cruz is facing a beatdown. Cruz has got to get his wits about it. Just tossed. She got airline miles for that. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Ah, uh, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. out like Taffy right now. Julius Creed taking it down to the basement. Right for the ball with the clothesline. That's won it for Julius before. Cover. Wait, 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 wait. How can that be fair? Come on, ref. Keep these guys in check. He takes their breath out. Effective counter. Flurry of offense 
from Julius. Creed's proven hard to deal with. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Chopping neck breaker out. Detour out of harm's way. Oh, and he answers back on Cruz. We're gonna see it. And he's coming in hot. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Big splash. This match is brutality starting to show on him. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Gunbreak suplex. Clean tag for his partner. Fast press! Fast press! Fast press! He thinks he has it! And a strong kick out at one. He's still got more left in the tank. Counter! And now there's an opening. <laughs> round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. Hooked up, DDT! Tagged into action. Right. Oh, God! Suicide! Oh. Nice amateur takedown. to make his move. No breaker! Great athleticism. Able to evade. Close line! And elusive Kemp there. And now thrown back into the ring. Tag made. Tag made. Wait for it. Boom! With the clothesline. That's won it for Julius before. 
makes the cover. Oh, that was close. This match continues. See the punishment on Wyatt's face. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him, Michael. Uh oh, for the top. Ripped off the ropes in a hurry. And that's going to keep Wyatt off balance. Creed's focus has to turn toward ending this very soon. him back in now. Close line! Oh, that'll leave a mark. Joaquin Wilde trying to start something that I'm not sure. Finish. Running Hurricane Rana! Watch out! Running swinging net breaker. Jeez, that could take you out. Wild now looking to go high risk. To the skies. Oh, misses the mark. Shoulders down. And he makes the save for his team. To the midsection, sunset flip. Oh, into a power bomb. Right. Look at this. Oh, nice. Kick to his green. with a crucial elbow. Elbow smash! Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Oh, round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. Ah, look at this. An arm breaker. Reaches his partner for the tag. Look out! What a DDT! Flame metal on it! That's how you impress. Drop kick right on point. Big impact off the neck breaker. So stopping the stop. Got the arms. Oh, 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 oh. Neck breaker. Can that keep Ray down? Two. Wow. Just barely making it out. Giving up has never been part of Ray Mysterio's character. Proof positive right there. That move has brought victory before, but not on this occasion. Might be time to think outside the box. It's been a hardship for these superstars to get to this point. I think these fans are driving them to claw that extra inch. You can sense the ride these fans have been on, and I'm right there with them. Launching. Well scouted reversal there. There's a tag. Just 
just dished out his most devastating offense. And you got to be wondering if he's thinking one more time will be the charm. Say goodnight. Sleeper hold locked in. There's the save. How close was that? Up into a fireman's carry position. Oh, fireman's carry in a rolling hills. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Oh, Damon answers back. Stretch in. The stretch it out the arm. Oh, man. You didn't need that eyebrow anyway. And Damon has earned the upper hand here. It's so hard to predict what Kemp's going to do next. Superstar standing in this matchup. Oh, yeah, you have to believe this win is going to stick with them for a long time. Surviving against all these other superstars and standing tall here and now. Whew. Long match between the LWO and Diamond Mine. Escobar. Coming out with the MVP for Team LWO with uh, two eliminations in that battle. So uh, LWO will face the ECW faction next week on NXT. On to our first championship match of the night for the Cruiserweight title. A ladder match, Axiom, ranked number one in the Cruiserweight division versus uh, Noam Dar. A champion. The following contest is a ladder match and is for the NXT Cruiserweight Championship. A genius high flyer. Axiom is so fun to watch. Introducing the challenger from Madrid, Spain. Weighing in at 154 pounds, Axiom. A mathematical savant who claims everything in the ring can be solved by equations. 
Given his success thus far, he may have the numbers right. Time to see if the calculations are correct for Axiom. And introducing the champion from Ayr, Scotland, weighing in at 178 pounds. He is the NXT Cruiserweight Champion, Noam Dar. Noam Dar, the first ever Israeli-born WWE superstar. The Scottish Supernova has done Scotland and Israel proud. The only man to hold the NXT UK Heritage Cup Championship more than once. That's a testament to the pure wrestling skills of the Scottish Supernova. Highly skilled. He's the first Israeli-born superstar to compete in WWE. He's got a, bit of, a little bit of his own swag going, too. He's smug. He's not smug, Cole. He's confident. The skies will be filled with high flyers in mere moments in this NXT Cruiserweight title match. Featuring the top WWE superstars under 205 pounds. Standing shooting star press incredible. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. Oh, the ring wants his plan here.
And Axiom becomes new cruiserweight champion. Makes it look easy on top of that. But next week, Noam Dar will exercise his rematch clause, of course, for the NXT title with an, uh, cruiserweight rules ladder match. And we will see that next week. On to the second championship match of the night for the North American title. Three-time former North American champion Wes Lee will exercise his rematch clause uh, after losing his title at SummerSlam to uh, Kevin Grimes, the new North American champion. So we'll, we'll see if uh, Wes Lee becomes four-time North American champion or... Will he be moving on to a different division tonight? The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT North American Championship. Gentlemen, it's time to keep your eyes on the skies. He was known as a tag team competitor before joining WWE, even won the Dusty Classic and NXT Tag Team Championships early in his WWE career but now has grown as a singles competitor too, winning the NXT North American Championship even. Somebody call air traffic control because Wesley is about to take flight. Prepare to see an air of the display like none other. Perhaps the richest man in all of WWE, Cameron Grimes. And guess what, Michael? His fortune is going to the moon. This is a man who owns lots of stock, but also lots of gold. You're right, Corey. He's held the NXT North American title, even held the Million Dollar Championship, too. Cameron Grimes looking to add a few more zeros to his bank account, courtesy of the winner's purse. Introducing the challenger from Dayton, Ohio, weighing in at 183 pounds, Wes Lee! And his opponent from Burlington, North Carolina, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the NXT North American Champion, Cameron Grimes! Here we go, this is what it's all about. The NXT North American Championship is on the line.
We've seen the NXT North American title in the middle of some of the fiercest matches on the black and gold brand. And for good reason, Michael, the North American Championship puts your name on a short list of champions. It also puts a huge target on your back. Double A drop. And all the impact brought to the knee. Oh, man. Great reaction from Wes. Stunner! Stunner! Stiff kick. Ooh! That hurt. And this one might be headed ringside. Corey, it's hard to know just what Wesley is going to throw at you. At times, it seems like he invents new moves mid-match. How is his opponent going to deal with that uncertainty? Wesley does have a big playbook, but most of those pages cover aerial attacks. If you can keep him grounded, he'll start to lose his advantage. Plus the educated hands and feet. Turn out the lights. Yeah. Crushing the knee there. Side in our announce 
table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Well, I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. So much torque on the knee and ankle. is one step quicker. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Now, that'll do some serious damage. Good night. West showcasing his strike. Yeah, Cameron just keeps getting cut down. Display of stamina. The champ showing they are truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. A new strategy is needed right about now if that could end things. It's been a hard hitting affair here tonight. These competitors are going to have trouble walking on their own after this one. Executive attacks keeping Grimes off his game. West continues on the assault, keeping things at his pace. He got whipped into that corner. Whoa, six, one, nine. What could West be looking for? Once more, setting it up. Oh, the champ was glazed over. Here's your winner, and new NXT North American Champion, Wes Lee. A night and title change we will all remember for a very long time. We really are looking at a new era, Cole. Soak it in. And Wesley becomes four-time North American champion. I mean, every time this guy loses his title, he gets it right back. And guess what? There will be a rematch clause by Cameron. The last rematch for this title and the stipulations will be by Wesley come next week. All right, our third championship title match of the night for the NXT tag titles rank number two Imperium versus the reigning NXT champions New Day uh, since it was a number two tag team uh, Joaquin and Cruz were involved in the opener Oh, not the opener. The second match in Faction Wars with LWO versus Diamond Mine. This is they are are legit, legitimately ranked number one in the tag division. But since they were involved in that match, uh, Imperium gets the shot at the titles. And the reason why there are three titles this week is because we couldn't fit all the title matches on SummerSlam from NXT, so it carried on to uh, NXT show this week so let's get it on Imperium has arrived a united group with one unwavering mission to prove that the mat is sacred.
Well, Imperium clearly are not here to have fun, but you have to respect their mission statement of the mat being sacred. Oh, I do, but I've seen your matches, Saxton, and you do not respect their mission statement. Have you seen my matches? I definitely consider the match sacred. Oh, my gosh. He's undefeated. We are moments away from seeing Imperium's mission statement in action. And that's unfortunate for anyone else in the ring. You eat your bootios with like almond milk? Well, of course, I don't have a sensitive system. Well, I'm Michael, say it with me. New Day Rocks. New Day Rocks. All right, we'll just keep it a circle, man. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 517 pounds, Ludwig Kaiser and Gunter Imperia. And their opponents at a combined weight of 417 pounds, they are the NXT Tag Team Champions, Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods, The New Day. Matchups like these are why I love tag team wrestling. Representatives of the New Day out here for this match. New Day loves to have fun, but guys, this is a tag team that could easily be considered one of the greatest of all time. Especially when they get rolling in the ring. New Day loves to pick up the pace, get the action going, and get the crowd pumping. Absolutely, Byron. And you can bet they'll try to do that here in this one. Good to be in Orlando, an adopted home of sorts for WWE. Yeah, there's lots of fun parks here, too. Saxon goes to those discount theme parks, just like he's a discount broadcaster. Hey, don't knock it till you try it, Corey. Not many people go to it, but that means there's no lines. Hey, want to go with me, Michael? No, Byron. No chance. Ever. Dominating yeah. crossbody. Uh, what a four. And a carefully measured knee drop. Tag made. Crush 
finishing. That was quite the impact on the apron. You might be in shock now, but you'll be feeling lasting pain for a few weeks to come. Kofi Kingston has the power of positivity coursing through his veins. Off to the top rope now. Sky high. All the way to the outside. Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Hooked up. with the setup. Oh, S-O-S. Is it enough? Two. Just gets the shoulder up. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Big forearm. Forearm across the back of the neck. What are we about to see? Oh, knee right to the hands. A third. He skirts away, living to fight another day. What a hot shot! It's all the way to the outside. Oh my God, that looked devastating. Shot to the chest. Lighten up the chest. He catches Guther with a big counter. goes to show you how much speed kills. Able to get there in time. Oh, God. The champ getting put to the test here. Oh, there's a submission on the way. It's in. Figure four leg lock. No choice. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Uh-oh. Targets the gut to end the offense and responds with a counter of their own. Boom! Boom! And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. He's got it. And he's able to count. Oh, Kaiser holding him at bay. What's coming next? Back suplex. Very nice. 
Catching the arm. DDT. What do you 
USA. I mean, this, this is this is amazing. Elbow finds the mark. Elbow after elbow. And a third! Here's the pin title on the line! He keeps his team in the match. Look at this. Just unloading. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Woods just took a shot that has painted his face with a crimson mask. And the New Day finally get dethroned by Imperium, the new NXT Tag Champions. Of course, uh, New Day will exercise the rematch clause next week. But, man, it's been a while since someone has beat the New Day for the tag titles. Ever since Gunther lost his Intercontinental Championship and uh, teamed up with, jumped in the tag division, it's been a long long ride for Imperium. And I forgot to mention, uh, Big E actually lost his Universal title versus Sheamus, so he has a rematch clause coming up on SmackDown. Same with Giovanni. Lost his Intercontinental title at SummerSlam versus Rick Boogs, who also has a rematch clause coming up uh, on SmackDown. So, uh... Yeah, both uh, both teams uh, have a lot of belts. All right, on to our main event. Uh, the only rival match of the night, and this will be the final rival battle between Apollo Crews and Commander Aziz. Apollo Crews ranked number five in the NXT title division, and Commander Aziz ranked number two in the North American title division. Both guys have two victories each in this rival war. So, like I said, first to three wins the rival war. So this is the final match. Uh, the winner will get a title shot in the respective divisions. And this match will be a rival war match, which means there's a chance that somebody might get knocked out in this rival battle. Weighing in at 241 pounds, 
Apollo Crews. Made a return to NXT, joined the main event scene there, and is doing the best work of his career. Always had the athleticism, but now he has a drive like never before. Time for Cruz to execute on his vision. Well, I just hope he can do that without bleeding from his eyes. Would you look at the size of this human being? Seven feet tall. 355 pounds. Come on, let's go. And his opponent from Lagos, Nigeria, weighing in at 355 pounds, Commander Aziz. Such an impressive presence and an intimidating glare on the face of Commander Aziz. Oh, this dude, Commander Aziz, he's just ruthless. You know what they say, Cole, all is fair in love and war, but tonight, Aziz has chosen war. gentlemen as a superstar who's done waiting in line and is ready to chase after any goal he sets his sights on. Yeah, Cruz is looking at friendships and playing Mr. Nice Guy in the locker room getting his way anymore. Apollo has a rich legacy to carry forward and he'll go through anyone to do it. In some ways you have to respect his determination makes Cruz a very dangerous man. But he's got to contend with the imposing Commander Aziz, a towering figure who always seems disgusted by his competition. His stern expression alone is enough to send a shiver down your spine. You paint a grim picture, Saxton. Commander Aziz isn't stern. He just has a healthy amount of pride in himself. You would, too, if you had an incredible physique like he does. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Oh, uh, to the arm. Terrible. I don't like the look in his eye. From the heavens, the from the top. Oh, that'll weaken your arm. Oh, ouch. I think that attack might have wounded Commander Aziz's pride. Apollo just made it clear he is done playing nice. As the wrist trapped, and this is just next level brutality. position now. Ah, he's got that boot right up against oh, his face. Come on. Aziz able to counter. Ball kick connects.
cover. Aziz has his anger fueling him now. Solely focused on punishing the leg. I think the fuse has been lit here, guys. Yeah, Saxton. Now we'll see if this is dynamite or a duck. And it looks like Commander Aziz will be the one getting a title shot for the North American title. But of course, he will have to wait his turn because Cameron Grimes is going to exercise his rematch clause for next week. So uh, we could see uh, we could see Commander get a shot at the title uh, two weeks from now on NXT. And that is it for today. I might do another show after I take a shower. AEW will be the next show. Faction Wars will continue. And along with number one contenders matches for titles on AEW. Since, it, since it's Battle of the Belts week for uh, AEW. So that will be next on the next uh, AEW show. Thanks for watching. Good night. God bless.